Good morning again. Let's try this take two. Um, I was here for about two minutes uh, a few minutes ago, and of course, Mr. Charlie decided to have a pee pee in my office. So uh, we had to shut the live stream off. So I deleted that. We are going to give it a go again. Good morning, Team Moneymakers. I hope you guys are having an awesome Monday thus far. Um, it is what? Here in Florida, it is 1045 in the morning. Uh, I am pretty much bare faced this morning, a little lip gloss, a little uh, blush, and coming to you live, uh, puppy or no puppy, hopefully he is not getting into trouble. Let me just make sure he's not behind my desk. Nope, he's he's under my chair. We're good to go. It is like having a toddler all over again, y'all. Um, he did sleep good last night, so I got a pretty good night's sleep, and we're feeling the good vibes. So I hope you guys are having a great Monday thus far. Wanted to just touch bases with you guys on a few important reminders that today being Monday, we are closing out very soon here on Campaign 15. Don't forget, tomorrow by 5 p.m. to have all of your Campaign 15 orders in, no later than... As you know, I always recommend that you get them in one to two days before the deadline so that there's no issues with the processing um, of your order. And, you know, if it goes in too late, it ends up looking like the following campaign. So we don't want that. Another reminder is that if you are doing online orders from online customers, don't forget that they are currently counting them as the day they ship towards your campaign. So if you're in Kickstart or you're trying to reach a certain level for sales to get to that next percentage and you're not uh, President's Club and above, it is important to know that they are counting those orders as of the ship date, not as the date that it's placed. Now, I have been on the line with Avon. I have gone up to the board to see if they will make an exception and change that rule to be at the time the order is placed. That is when the award sales should count for us. So stay tuned. We are waiting to see uh, if they will be listening on that and making the proper adjustments. But as of right now, e-store orders, when shipped, is when they're counting for your award sales. So I know that can be confusing when you're in Kickstart and other things. So we're working on it. Stay patient. If for some reason you're in Kickstart and something does go in later than it should have and you were counting on that for your Kickstart and it's in the date range for that particular campaign, then you can make a call for an exception. Um, to tell them, you know, I was counting on this for my kickstart and it went in during the date range and that's when I was expecting it and we can work on getting that corrected for you. I know Abby recently, uh, we had to call on that and Abby haven't heard back from you as to whether they accepted that exception or whether we're still, you know, whether they're still counting it. Look at this weird hair. It's like a duck this morning. What is going on here? Huh. Anyway, hair is hair. So anyway, uh, distraction, Dory over here. So uh, anyway, I wanted to remind you guys of that. Also, we had our Campaign 14 Challenge, which was selling, uh, we had the Campaign 14, let's see, was a new skincare and lip glow, and that was, the winner of that was Kayla Somerville. Hello, David, good morning. And then we have for Campaign 15, don't forget, again, closing out by 5 tomorrow, don't forget by Friday, um, I believe I said by Friday, I'll give you guys till Friday, to report to me. Any masks that you sell during campaign 15, uh, for every three, you, well, for the first three, you get one entry, and then every mask after that is one entry. The prize is either is a box of Avon goodies, $50 value uh, for the winner. It could be also, if you choose, branded items such as business tools and things like that worth up to $50, so your choice. Remember, you have to be in it to win it. So if you are not reporting to me by the deadline Friday, I don't just go through sales and say, oh, this person sold that, that you're entered, you're entered. No, you've got to PM me. You've got to text me. You've got to let me know how many you sold and how many entries you are supposed to be getting for your name to be in it. So uh, there's been a few incentives that we've done where only like two and three people have entered. So their chances are amazing. So you're missing out if you're not entering these contests. I mean, they're winning $50 prize bundles, $50 cash. Uh, don't miss out. So that's 15 and 15 is ending, okay? Uh, wanted to kind of go over the next what's new. And that is what's new cover campaign 17. So 15 is ending. For those newbies out there... Hang tight and get my book. If you are placing Wednesday for campaign 16, you are at the start of the campaign 16, which I place on Wednesday. So my campaign 16 order 
will be going in this Wednesday, or am I off? Hang on, with this holiday, let me check, hold on. I don't want to freak everybody out here. I probably am. Hold on. Let's see. 15. I am so, so off. Wait a minute. No, I'm not. We are ending. 710. God, I'm so screwed up from the holiday. How about you guys? Are you all screwed up from the holiday? I thought last week after the 4th of July, it seemed like it was uh, Monday the next day. So I'm a little bit messed up. So excuse me. Uh, and it's Monday morning. So, you know, I'm allowed to be a little messed up. So campaign 15 was on 627 ends tomorrow, Tuesday, by 5 p.m. So then we do go into campaign 16 starting on Wednesday and that is the 11th of July and it ends on the 24th of July this book. Um, don't forget they are going to be removing the dates off the back because there was a lot of us that complained about that because we want our books to be able to be out there for back order two campaigns or longer uh, for people to call us and ask for a current brochure. So if you're like me, I placed this Wednesday for this book, and some of you will be placing closer to the 24th, so you're just, you'll just be starting it. I'm just about finishing this one, okay? When you place your Campaign 16 order, always look at your demo book that is coming up. So this is going to be the cover of Campaign 17. So if you're ordering out of 16, you know, 16 is getting ready to be placed, you want to be looking at 17 and 18 because these are the two demo books that you can begin to order early so that you can start promoting these products and getting advanced orders. I am super excited about this one right here. This one has some good fashions in it and some th that I particularly like and a lot of good uh, mixed metals. So for you ladies, um, you know, if you work still uh, the regular day job or you're out and about or going, I mean, wearing something like this out and showing people that it's Avon and telling them the price um, is going to help you sell more of them. Remember, I talked before about having uh, for you men that are on the team, you can have a jewelry model, you can have a fragrance model. And what that is, I've talked about this before, is having somebody, um, whether it's somebody you work with, a coworker, your sister, your hairdresser. Having, bringing in a piece of jewelry and saying, would you do me a favor and wear this this whole week? And if you can get a couple sales by sharing it with people, I'll let you keep this one. Now, if they, and you have to have a, a, a stipulation. So it might be like if you sell five of them, you get to keep yours for free. Or if you sell any of them and you happen to really like the necklace, I'll give it to you at demo price. Because you could pick it up demo for them wearing it, let them buy it from you for demo price. They're advertising for you. You can do the same thing with fragrance. So I love being able to do that. Fragrance models, jewelry models, uh, you can have them do anything to help you sell a product and give them incentive to do so. Uh, really nice new breast cancer products. Look how adorable that is with the um, locket picture. Love, love, love. And this, let's see. This is for PC members. This is why you want to be President's Club. If you're a President's Club and above member, you can pick up this amazing bundle for only 30, wait, let's see, hold on, $35. Yes, $35. And you get the award sales of 111 So I definitely took advantage of that. We'll, we'll do it again because it doesn't say, um, no, it says no limit. So for Delena and all the rest of you that are PC and above, Honor Society and above, take advantage of those. Those make great gifts as well. We still have our bug guard in this brochure. We also have scented pages for you guys that did not know. There are scented pages in the demo book as well as the regular brochure. So usually if you're seeing it here, you're going to see it also in the brochure. So show your customers the scent circles. This helps you decide whether you want to order the sample as well. But remember, there might be something that you smell that you don't really like, but maybe your customers are going to love. So, but if you love it, of course, it's a lot easier to sell it because you're wearing it and you love it. And so I love the scent of the Haiku um, original and then the Haiku reflection. Oh my God, it smells so good. Um, yes, actually you can. Um, I have, but I currently, the only thing about back ordering out of the demo is if it's already in your current brochure, don't forget that you are getting higher award sales. Like, for example, you could be in this campaign and back order out of the demo, but if you order it out of here, you're getting the full award sales. And if you order it out of the demo book, you're getting it at demo price award sales. So keep that in mind, especially if you are trying to reach the next level of sales. For example, 150 when you're not on Kickstart is 30%. So if you went ahead and back ordered something out of, out of the demo that's the same book you're currently in, 
and it drops the entire order by $10, $15 and puts you at $130, it probably would have made sense to just leave it in the book to give you that extra 10%. So just pay attention to that. And yes, though, you can back order in the demo. So don't forget the scent circles in the demo books. Those are great. And then all the, you know, the, the samples are here in numbers. But don't forget when you go to your My Orders area, you have where you can do the samples. Now, um, you may have seen yesterday, I posted some puppy pictures and I was wearing this awesome new top. It is so comfortable. It is so boho. It is so cute. Um, the fabric is amazing. And I also bought this dress, which I did a photo shoot with my granddaughter yesterday. Super comfortable, super flowy, great summer dress. It's got this beautiful detail on the sleeves of the crochet. And if you're into like the longer skirts, like the high low, this is really cute also. Now I have heard that the other white shirt, I don't know about this white shirt, but the other crochet white shirt sold out like that. So if you're loving this kind of stuff, I mean, get the fashions, wear them. It does make a difference in your sales. Love, love, love. And, oh my gosh, every time they come out with the candles, I just can't control myself, okay? So six candles for $50. You know what I do with these? I cash and carry these with me. Um, people, when it comes to stuff like this, yes, sometimes we have scented pages, but having it on hand, and letting them being able to open it up and actually smell it right then and there, you can sell them on the spot. So this is six candles for $50, okay? So it's $119 value. These are going to sell in the book for $11.99. So you could sell them, even if you sold them for $10 a piece, just as a special, you could do that and you're still gonna make your money because then you'd be making $60, okay? So if you do them for the 12 bucks flat, you could say they're $12 even. Don't do the tax on them when you do cash and carry. Um, and then you're still going to make your profits and have the award sales towards your level. So these are great to do. Of course, they got it in wildflower honey, blackberry jam, sea salt verbenum, saint, uh, summer rain, and a spiced pear. Yum. Um, and what a deal at $50 for six candles. So, and then we've got our spirit in the back, and don't forget a box on the back if you're wanting to demo those. So that is going to be ordered when you're placing your campaign 16 order. Okay, the next one. I'm in love with campaign 18. Guys, this new mascara and lash serum, the lash serum in particular, if you have looked at the pricing, go do your research on what lash serums cost. Um, you will be so blown away because when I first saw what our lash serum costs when it's not on sale, it's going to be $60, and but it's going to come out at $39.99 um, initially to our customers, and they're going to be getting a free eye lift serum with their purchase. So they're going to buy the serum for $40 on intro price because it will go to $60, and they're going to get a $28 uh, eye lift, Okay. That is an awesome deal, okay? Because that's a $28 value. Mm -hmm. um, our cost for one serum is going to be $23.99. Now, the whole idea of the serum, mm -hmm. guy is, guys, is to get them hooked on the serum, get them using it and seeing the results, and then once they see the results, they're going to come back for more and be that $60 customer, okay? Um, what I love that Avon has done here with this offer so plan, plan ahead now, plan ahead. And guys, you could use the serum too if you have short lashes or brows, if your brows are thinning because this is lash and brow, put it in your brows, put it on your lashes and you know take some before and after pictures. I look like I got no lashes today, guys, because it's Monday and I don't have any makeup on. Um, but this here, 50% for everybody. You don't have to be President's Club, so that is super exciting. Good morning, Arthur. Thank you for joining me. All right, so you can get the pack of one, which gives you five mascaras, and then you get eight free products because you're going to give them, you're selling the uh, the lash serums, right? They get a free eye lift with their the lash serum. So you will, <coughs> excuse me, you will give them their free, but there is a total of six there plus an extra free one. Um, and then also a mascara, the new mascara. So amazing, amazing. You pay $99.97. You're going to turn around and sell those for $40 a piece. They get the free thing. That is an instant cash and carry sale. If you can invest in the $99 deal 
and then turn around and sell those serums, you are going to get lash customers that will come back for more and more. Hello, Tina. Thanks for watching. Your award sales is going to be full at $199.95. So that counts for you if you're in Kickstart. You pay $99 and they're giving you $199.95 towards your award sales. This is awesome. And you can begin to order this in 16 and 17. So, <coughs> God, I'm choking to death here. Hang tight. All right, we're good. Okay, so amazing. Now, if you have a lot of customers and you've been doing this a while and you've already been hyping this product up, it might be a good time to... Uh, Talk to the customers that you think will pre-order, and then maybe you end up with buying the two packs. Um, you would earn $337 when you sell all of it. You would pay $199, but your award sales would be $399.90, okay? I don't recommend you take the larger bundles unless you have a plan of who's buying, okay? I don't like to see anybody go into hock and have extra product that they can't sell. I think pack one, is very reasonable for any representative to talk about it now, talk about the benefits, find your few customers, because here's the thing. If you sell three of them, just three at $40, you would have $120 that you would pay, right? You would have already earned $20 and paid the $99.97, which is the bill, okay? Selling two of them is $80. Your bill is $99.97. So sell three of them, you paid the bill and you're starting to profit and you still have three to go, okay? So all of you could sell three serums. Sell three serums and you get all the free product, you give them the free eye cream. Sound like, sound like a plan? I think you guys can do this. I, I don't think, I know you guys can do this, okay? So look at your profits too. You can do this with all things. This does not have to just be this particular Lash serum, but I'm telling you, the 50% deal really does make it sweet, uh, and it's sweet for the customers because they are getting a free eye lift, which I love the eye lift. I didn't put it on today. Should have put it on today because it really does, and the hat's probably giving me dark circles, and the puppy is giving me dark circles. But at any rate, have to share that, and then we have the new Love Mascara, which I can't wait to try this stuff. I'm going to be ordering it Wednesday because that's when I get to place my campaign 16. I place early, so super excited about that. Um, let's see, men's fragrance we've got in here with the rub your wrist. Uh, and David says he loves the eye lift. I got the men watching this morning, good morning. Um, yes, you can back order, like I think I said. So, you know, you got the scented pages. It smells so good, you know, just rub your wrist and make sure you try that. 40% uh, off deals, of course, pretty much in the demo. I flagged, let's see, why did I flag this page? Oh, I flagged this page because I love turtles. I love turtles. I sound like that kid. I love turtles. Um, I love turtles. I love sea turtles. And I thought this was a great statement piece. Uh, there's also the um, owl. And they open up and they're like the classic Avon where they have the Avon stamped on the back, which is something they used to do. Like, it's bigger print, so that's kind of nice. But they do double as... Um, little locket. So I love that. I think if you're wearing that, and then if you have people that are into giraffes or zebras or elephants, or it looks like a lion, let's see, it is a lioness. Um, we've got wild things, jewelry. We have the watches to match. So pair that up and be like, oh, you can get the, you know, you got the lion. Maybe you like uh, tigers and lions. And, or if you got the, for example, the giraffe, then they could get the giraffe watch and pair it together. Don't forget those add-on sales, guys. Show them your brochure. Don't just hand the brochure up and go, there you go, um, you know, whatever. Show what you're excited about. If you are actually seeing these customers say, oh my gosh, I know you have grandchildren. Look at our new kids line. My grandchildren are using this. It smells so good. And they really are. They're using it. It smells so good. Um, it's paraben free. There's no tears. It's not harsh. My granddaughter's hair can be brushed and it's give them the benefits. Show the excitement. If you don't have little kids, do you have a neighbor that has kids? Give them a bottle and say, would you do me a favor and try this out and let me know what you think about it? If you really like it, I'll give it to you at my cost. Okay. Get the testimonials. Order the product. Okay. Utilize it. This is an awesome, awesome opener. It's right on the cover. You've got to learn to not be afraid to share your excitement for our products, okay? Um, find something you love. Men, I, we've got men on the line here. If you love the candles, 
share it. If you love our men's fragrance, you got to wear it. You got to share it. Okay. Um, ladies, get those dresses, get the, get the lip gloss, put your makeup on, share your excitement for the, I am in love with the glow drops. I don't have them on today. Like I said, I'm minimal right now. I've got a little bit of foundation on barely there, lip color. And I was just saying that for those that in the other live stream before the puppy peed on the floor, um, if ladies, if you've not tried our cream blush, let me give you a tip on this. It's so easy to apply. You just swipe it like this, put it on, okay? Rub it in. You can you can build upon it. And then what I like to do after that is you now this isn't a very punchy color. This is like a real neutrally neutral color. As a matter of fact, this is golden rose, I think this one's called. So it's not a this is not a very dark color. But what I like about this is if they if you want this to really stay all day, this is luminous. So for older ladies, as I'm getting older too, just had a birthday. I like this because it's not powdery. It's not cakey powdery. It's just luminous. It gives me a little bit of luminous. And like I said, don't mind my appearance today. Um, but what I like to do to really set it, let's say I really want it to go a long time. You could go ahead and follow up with a little bit of blush and don't sweep it. Do this right up in here. And also a mistake a lot of women are making is they're going like this. Everybody always said, put in the apple of your cheeks and smile. Well, here's the thing. As you get older, I'm more suddenly going into a makeup lesson here. You never know what I'm going to do when I'm alive. Okay, so if you're doing this, watch happens when you stop. If you did this and you put the blush here, where, where does it go? It's up here and now it's down here. So I don't recommend, especially if you're older, that you tell people to smile and put on the apple because when they put the apple down, you've dropped the blush to here. So what I've been taught is to sweep the blush up into this area here, and there's nothing on this brush, and to pat it in. Because if you sweep, you're going to take off all the foundation and all your hard work. So tap it in, flick your brush off, tap it in up here. If you're doing this first, you can sweep it up in here, pat it in, you can add your highlight, and then if you want to really give it a power punch, like I said, I'm not wearing much at all today, tap this in, flick it off, put it up here. Don't do this. If you're older and then your cheek drops and then the blush is down here. Okay. Just a tip. It's something I've been meaning to share. Hopefully it helps you guys when it comes to that application. All right. Like I said, you never know what I'm going to talk about. Um, so let's see. What else did I want to share with you? We had a winner for campaign 14 and that was Kayla for selling lip gloss and the uh, new products. Congratulations again, Kayla. And don't forget our challenge for the end of 15. You've got to uh, come to me by the end of this week. I will give you till Friday all sales of the mask from campaign 15. The multi-masking, if you've been talking about it, if you've been telling people the benefits of the brightening, the detoxifying, um, the, the soothing, you've got to give them the benefits and how excited you are and how they can use them on different parts of their face um, for only $10 a mask. They could have a girl's night. They could pamper themselves. Give them the benefits. Share it with them. If you sell three of them, okay, you get a ticket. If you sell for every one after the third one, you get another ticket. And I am giving away, once again, either a $50 product bundle or $50 in business tools that you can use. So it can be a gift card to town and country so you can go and buy the things that you need. I mean, if you are not in it, you can't win it, guys. And, you know, there's there's been a couple raffles here I've had where there's only like one and two people in it. So if you're not reporting it to me, I'm not going to go ahead and just look and find it, you need to come to me and say, hey, Lisa, I sold six of those masks, so I get four entries for this particular contest, and I will put you in the contest. So please let me know by this Friday your mask sales for campaign 15 so that you can be entered to win the $50. Hello, Elaine. Hello, Levi and Jennifer. Good to see you guys. If you want to, we're almost finished here, so you'll have to watch from the beginning. We talked about, to recap, we talked about the new Lash Serum. We talked about how to order some things out of the demos. Uh, guys, one last thing before I go. This is going to be the cover of 19. And we are being told that when we place our Campaign 17 order, that'll be around when we're at RepFest, they are not going to be releasing these books right away because there's some sort of giant reveal. That's why it says this is big. 
and there's a stool. We're trying to all figure out what this means. There's a stool and camera lights. What possibly could this as big mean? An Avon first. The C19 brochure is like nothing you've ever seen. So be sure that when you're placing your Campaign 17 order, it says to order enough of the Campaign 19. So listen to them because the last time they did something big, I know one time we had, just like magazines do, we had the actual sample like on the cover, which was great. So people could use it right then and there. One year we maximized the size of the book and it, although it looked pretty, it was like, it was like this size. Okay. Maybe a little bit smaller, but it was a big size book instead of it being our current catalog size. It was like a giant size. So when we see big, we're like, oh my God, are they going to go back to the large brochure? I don't know what it, the secret is, but those of you going to RepFest, that's where the reveal is going to happen. So we've all had our guesses in trying to figure out what could it be, what could it be. Nobody knows what it's going to be until we're at RepFest. So um, stay tuned again when you get ready to play 17. Make sure you're ordering enough brochures for 19 because evidently this is going to be big according to this. All right, so before I go, guys, does anybody have any other questions? Anything you want to share? Um, you know, I know a lot of you have been watching this on replay. I'm so glad the puppy went to sleep. He was not asleep when I started the first live stream. Maybe now I can go finish my, my makeup and finish some of my work while he's sleeping. Uh, because when I tried to live stream this a little bit earlier, um, we had a PP accident and I had to shut it off and he's sleeping now. So we're good. So I hope you guys have a, re a great rest of your day. Uh, I hope you have a great rest of your week. Uh, for again, for those catching the end of this, tomorrow's last day for 15. Don't forget to place your order. If you are brand new and you are not placing till campaign 16, um, then you know, you have the full two weeks, but if you are new and you are placing, by the end of 15, don't forget your kickstarts. Don't forget the incentive that I put to new reps. If your first order is 150, you get the name tag. Um, and I think that's about all. Unless you guys have questions, I will look for them later on here for those watching the replay. Have an awesome week, everybody. You can do it. Go Team Moneymakers. See you soon. Bye.